Oh, I just noticed I forgot to put something on the guy's book there. Hold on. All right, let's start over. There we go. The guys are, I'm going to call these guys good. Call them done. Um, so this 40 is about minutes because uh, I was thinking through stuff. But I oiled up the guns with oily steel. Um, pretty common color. Even did his. I even touched up this guy's thing. I just tried that. And I also tried this guy. It's okay. I don't know. It's pretty blocky. But that's okay. I'm experimenting. It's cool. Um, I don't know if you noticed, but if you go look at my previous video, these guys were pretty dark. So I went through again. I got a... Because I used a little thick of brush on the brown on a couple of these guys. I think these three. Uh, shoot. Yeah, it would have been these three here. Actually, it might have been all these guys. Um, one of the guys I kept light. I think it was this guy I kept light. Anyway, for sure, I definitely painted it. So I touched it up with some of the that German camo beige. I just kind of went through there. And so it was, it looks like, like on the helmet and all that. Um To make that stand out and i stood out their legs a little bit more the oily so there you go there they are all right i see errors for improvement but i'm gonna stop because you can keep going then i put some little grass little flowers and stuff hey you little flowers and there's the map there's no he's where he's going use the, the silver on the binoculars binox um and i did that guy and i i don't know that, not that it really matters but put some just to see what it looked like on that and on this guy over here and then on this guy i silvered up that little piece in there just because and then i um did a couple little parts there. i think you're supposed to use a darker color for that but i just thought it would look cool with the silver kind of like you know where they step on i'm sure there would be more little elements here and there a little much on that actually now that i look at it a little bit on the side where they scrape the paint off. I know it would be probably a little darker and rustier. Then I did that just to help it stand out. Just kind of lightly brushed it and got the pick. So there you go. I'm, I'm liking it. I need to paint that gun. So I bet I'm going to forget that gun. Um, all the way to the end. So that's cool. So now let me make progress on the other Germans. So now I can kind of crank them out uh, as a gun barrel said factory style. These other guys. So, you know, I can do all the boots, which I think I already did. They've already washed, so now I just got to figure out how I'm gonna how I'm gonna highlight them up. Um, I might just kind of dry brush them or something. Yeah, I don't know. That's that's the problem, you know, because I spray painted. Well, I spray painted, then I wash, and then I'm just gonna go highlight. But it's gonna have to look different than that. I'm not really sure I'm liking that. It's a little much, or that other guy you saw. So, um, whereas these guys look pretty good. So why did these guys turn out? I paint the gun black. Got to paint all their helmets, that camo beige. I might write down what I need to do. Might help me go through it faster. All right, that's it. Look good. Oh, that was a long one. Sorry about that, everybody. And uh, 20 or 40 minutes a day. We'll get it done. Say yep.